Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Abul Ghassan. I am come from Sweden and I am studying international relations in high school and I am go to the second of high school. And it's my first travel to Iraq and visit to Karbala and Najaf. It's really hard to describe it or impossible to describe it. Describable. Because Karbala had a full sentence, really hard to to say in a sentence for Karbala. You came here and f do you forget anything? You forget f anything from uh, of your problem, what you have. Uh, I have I have many problems in my life now because I live alone in this country because my nationality is from Afghanistan and I live alone there and I have uh, too many uh, Swedish friends in my school and I have just contact with them many of them is not don't have don't accept any God and or don't true to any God when I talk to say I'm Shia and I believe in God and uh, I true the f there was one God to control all over in the world. They did not accept, and they they had too many questions and ask ask me how how you feeling? How how is your God? Why your God did not help to poor countries? Why they live in the bad bad? Bad situation, really bad situation, trouble situation, war, and every uh, um, uh, this uh, how I can say uh, Iraq, uh, Iraq, like Iraq, Afghanistan, Iran, and uh, Syria. Why you have a problem there? If the God, if the God, if the God is uh, Merciful, if the if God is, if you you have a God, if if God is is in the world and world has one God, why God did not help other people? And those question, uh, those question, so really shocking my my self confidence. How I can do? How I can? Uh, give the answer for that qu uh, question. How I can do that? But that made made me a little sad, and that's why I I think I must find a place to give self confidence and give more information, not from some person to uh, to give uh, information and give them information. No, I wanna to. Because I heard from someone, Goodman, say to me, if you want to open your brain, so you must find the place, that place must be holy, and you must contact with God, to God help you to find the answer. And therefore I came to Iraq and Karbala. In European country, you, 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 you give, you get too many information from uh, from many news and give you information how is now in Karbala or how is now a situation in Iraq. And my friends in Swedish, where I actually I did not say to them I will travel to Karbala. I said I I will. Uh, travel in Iraq and meet my dad and actually it's mo not my um, uh, my real dad like like blood and uh, this uh, connection uh, because I was thinking for Ali ibn Abi Talib because in Arabic we say Abu Turab is dad for everything that's why I used 
uh, Ali ibn Abi Talib for, I'm sorry, Ali ibn Abi Talib for my dad and say, I will meet my dad there. And uh, that, that was my uh, answer to my friends. They say to me, it's really dangerous if you want to travel to Iraq, maybe you die. I said, no, I, actually I don't have uh, any, uh, I, I will not think if I die because I believe that when the time comes you want to die, so, you, so you, you will die. You will die and on the time and not one second after, one second before. Exactly at the time you will die. So uh, I was not thinking about no, Karbala uh, located in, in danger. Yes, but now in Karbala it's very, very hard security and very good for the uh, for this uh, this one that came to Karbala and do pilgrims so for me if I want to say to the youth when I came to Karbala you are welcome to Karbala Karbala I I did not sit uh, I did not saw any any problems here we're good security keep me like good share a real Shia, Shia Amir al Mu'minin Ali ibn Abi Talib. It's my, it's my real wish to be real Shia, because the real Shia and to be real Shia is really hard. Real Shia has a very very good mind and the very good help helpness to other people, and. Real Shia, when real Shia uh, located some, uh, some problem, will not give, give up and will give his, uh, his right to other one. Because Imam Ali said, if you are real Shia, if you are a Muslim, not Shia, if you are Muslim, you must uh, choose it, that one you want for yourself, to your friends. And it's, it's Shia for Shia. And too many good things for, for Shia. My decision to be good Shia and was some, some man to give not or give it shame to Amir al Mu'minin. And be good man, be good human, be good Shia when other one a Christian or other religion when they want to meet me and see me. So don't say that he is Muslim and he is tourist. No, he is Shia. And Shia Amir al Mu'minin is very kind and good people in the world. In the future, as I said, I am reading international religion. And I, my decision to work with this organization work uh, with uh, other countries or any uh, big country like Ifan and uh, European Union. That's my decision. And actually, I came to Karbala and give the pride from Imam Hussein, from Amir al Mu'minin, and from Abel Fazl al Abbas to help me because I'm alone in Sweden. And to come to this level, so I must get really, really big and great help from them. Otherwise, it's impossible to come to this level and, and come to this, uh, this way for, for international relations. Maybe you know inter international relations is really hard to come in a, in a university. So I came to give pride, uh, pride from Imam Hussein and Abu Fazl al Abbas. If they accept me, so I am waiting to give help from them. If Imam Hussein accepts me, I will be re a real re uh, servitor. Actually, my plan be a servitor 
a servitor for Imam Hussein, not be Shia. Shia is very high. I want to be the servitor. And I want from Imam Hussein to, uh, to write my name for every year to came Karbala and visit Karbala. Because when I came here, so I will write again in my heart Imam Hussein's name and Abul Faz's name. And I'm, that I will feel I'm Shia and I will come to Karbala and visit Imam Hussein and read this, this internal, international religion. In the future, I'll be a great Shia to give up the Shia's name in the world. It's Shia for Amir al Mu'minin Ali ibn Abi Talib. If one, I advise to my friends, I would say, don't be afraid. Why you are afraid? Why you are afraid, really? If you are afraid of free relief, you will not develop in your life. Imam Hussein, if you want to come to visit Imam Hussein, I will, I will say surely that Imam Hussein will get your secrets. Really, and you, you will, you, your life will not come to, to any danger. Imam Hussein is here. Imam Hussein is not dying. Imam Hussein is alive. Abu Fazl was alive. Came to Karbala. Came to Karbala. You will not find any danger. And you will get the heart feeling from Imam Hussein and heart feeling that you are Shia. You're welcome. And I, I will get you the greatness uh, to invite me here and say something to my friends and other Shia uh, and this great place behind me is Abu Fazl Abbas, Maqam Abu Fazl Abbas and Ziyar Abu Fazl Abbas. For me is, how I can say, unbelievable. I'm really unbelievable and thank you.